Hello. Hello. You recording, Daniel? Still I'm recording. recording. I'm recording. <laughs> Go. What's up, bitches? Dude, Welcome dude. to Ace Attorney. We're back. Ace Attorney Woo! Phoenix Trilogy TMTM. Right. <laughs> yes. Finally back after a month. No, it's probably not going to be a month in the footage. It's probably going to be like a year between episodes. That's what's going to happen. <laughs> We're just going to release like it a year away. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so last time we were here, we dealt with uh, Matt Pat and uh, Shelly the Killer. <laughs> so now we're gonna do something else: Trials and Tribulations, the third game, the final game. Actually, Woo, it's very exciting. Woohoo. Let's do this. All right. So without further ado, let's do this. <laughs> oh wait, don't continue. New game. Yeah. <laughs> New game. Yeah. We completely we are excited. Forgot. With a different game. Now there's I a can... reason why I didn't want to show you guys the opening cutscene because I feel like if I showed you the opening cutscene. Things might have happened. Let's watch. Oh, okay. Oh. You, would have, you, would have, you would have had uh, anxiety for a month. Really? I probably oh, won't yeah, even yeah, remember yeah. it. Honestly. Not a good idea. I'm, I barely remember I the last one. I'm glad we right, didn't until this. this one, though. All right, let's go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go. Let's do this. Turn about memories. Turn about memories. Is this young Phoenix? Is he? Ooh. Yo, Phoenix is drip gangster Phoenix. He got, dra <laughs> he got the eyes, yo. yo. <laughs> He's straight up dripping. All right. All right, let's go. It's me, a fey looking. This <laughs> no, I'm not even going to comment. <sighs> How did I get into this mess? Assuming this is Phoenix. Yeah. No, this is not that, isn't it? Why? No. no. <laughs> Why did I do that? Who is this? Is that Edgeworth? Someone that girl, her. you shouldn't see her anymore. Hey, it's none of your business. I'm telling you for sake. If you continue to see her, it's gonna be bad news. Y you're lying. Just listen to me. There's something you need to know about that girl. She's Stop on fire. it! Don't talk about her like that. You fucking sim. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Just kill the guy. No Just way. Kill the guy. Oh yeah, this it person was at the con. P oh. it, it, it wasn't me. I, I, I didn't. I didn't do it. <laughs> I didn't oh. seem so hard, I killed no someone, I swear. Aw, oh, snappers. Oh, Whoa, Spikey's what? Ooh. Yeah, that's, so that's, that's why. Oh, Jesus, the same guards, the same furniture. April 11th? It's as if nothing's ever changed. Wow. <laughs> Isn't it April that is, now? That is somewhat that's close April. to the day. That is somewhat yeah, close, is. To, really today. close oh. to the day. I really like how we've... Just two weeks. About, yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay. <sighs> it's finally time. I'm kind of nervous. Who's this? <laughs> <laughs> yes. Oh, <laughs> oh uh, Mr. Grossberg. Uh, good morning. Oh, yes, me. Uh, please calm yourselves together now. You're going to get yourself arrested for suspicious behavior, you know. What are you talking about? I am relaxed, Mr. Goldspark. Look at me. I'm relaxed. <laughs> let's, let's go with my lapels. <laughs> okay. You obviously haven't got the temperament to be a lawyer. Uh, I, uh... I, 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 I'm so sorry. It's just that I'm so nervous for today. Oh, that's right. It's your first time in the big leagues, isn't it? Well, uh... Never fear, my dear. I, Marvin Grossberg, am at your service. Mm -hmm. Actually, this is my second time in court. Oh, still, you surprised me. What with your earnest request last night? Let me handle this case, you suddenly said, and quite forcefully, too. I, I, I just found it yesterday, about the casing. Mia, you didn't do your homework. You didn't do your homework. Shh, what? Okay. You didn't do your homework? And you've already I learned just... all the relevant facts? I was busy watching My Little Pony! Not <laughs> me! <laughs> yeah. Um, of course I have, I, I think. Oh dear. In any case, don't let our client see you see how nervous. Yeah. You see that poor young man in the pink sweater over there? That is our <laughs> client. Who the fuck are you calling poor? 
<laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, he was ahead of our time. He's uh, social Yo. distancing. He's social distancing. It's good. Good for him. Damn, five years early. Good morning, everybody. Uh, good morning. Uh, good morning. I think that's in a that's to yourself. Uh huh. This one. Try try to keep smiling, Mia. That's the. Oh, that, that... okay. oh sorry. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Good morning. Uh, trying to keep smiling, Mia. I uh, I just want to say, I'll give it all I've got. Yup, it'll be fine. No prob. <laughs> oh man. Oh. <laughs> uh, oh. Uh, what's wrong? Do you have a cold or something, Mister? Right. Actually, it's right. You know, like the Flying Brothers. Yeah, people screw it up all the time. And yes, I oh. have a cold. That—that's what this mask is for. M my doc says this way. I won't give it to anyone else. Be kind to others, he says. Right, Mister Right. You have nothing to fear in court today. If you are truly innocent, I promise I will save you. Mm. Please, let go of my shirt. <coughs> oh, oh, uh, th that's right. He's the one on trial, not you. Um, he's the one who should be nervous. Yeah, yeah. You need to stay strong for your client, Mia. <laughs> my name is Mia Faye. I'm pretty sh uh, new at this lawyer thing. The first time I appeared in court was a year ago. Ooh. You've had a year gap? Oh no. Okay, <laughs> but that trial traumatized me so badly. I thought I'd never be set. Uh, blah, blah. But that trial traumatized me so badly. I thought I'd never set foot in another court. True. It's been one year ever since. And and well, I'm here again. But this time, this time I'm going to win. I probably shouldn't have said that to my client. Um. <laughs> my client and myself. She just turns her back and like does a whole monologue. <laughs> yeah. Like to a wall. Oh man. What the fuck is, is that? that is that? Is that, what is that? Is that pain? Mr. Pain? Whatever way. It is. Oh, Court is now in session for the trial of Phoenix Wright. The defense is ready, Your Honor. Oh my the god. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. Whoa, look at <laughs> his look head. At the... Look at his What's dream. That? Yum. What's that called? Pompadour? He's in his prime. Oh, called... I don't Pania? Pania? know. It's Pompadour, yeah. Pompadour. <laughs> Damn, son. It's ready, Your Honor. today is Miss... Miss... Uh, Mia Fey, was it? Y yes, Your Honor. Is there a problem? I was under the impression that Marvin Grosberg was to be leading the defense. Yes, well, you see, um, I kind of stole his uh, idea or something. Um, Mr. Grosberg had a bit of uh, an emergency. Emergency? Have to go number two. Oh, dear lord, please keep this to yourself. Isn't that him standing right there next to you? Uh, yes, um, well... <laughs> you're, you're just a rookie. Are you sure you can really handle this? Don't let him scare you, Mia. Give me your toughest look. Oh, wow. <laughs> of course, dear honor, I think. Well, Mr. Payne, your opening statement, please. Me and the platypus. 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 Me and the the platypus. Me and 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 the platypus. Me <laughs> Doug Swallow! That pun will make Dog sense in a bit. Swallow. He was a fourth year. No, that's not the pun. <laughs> Wait, studying pharmacology. I, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Did he fucking swallow? <laughs> Did he choke? <laughs> Did he, yeah, yeah, is that so Did he, Is that how he died? <laughs> Let's see. Or swallow the fucking. The animal oh itself? Because like if he did, that would be a very hard pill to swallow, am I right? Oh, mm. he oh, did I... swallow a pill. Yes. He did. It sounds like he was a very bright young man. Yes, well, next we have a photo taken at the scene of the crime. Oh, shit. You're just sleepy. Students discovered the scene shortly after the murder. They found the victim's body. 
This is interesting. And the defendant, who had obviously bungled his getaway, they called them the police. Hmm, that certainly makes the defendant look very suspicious indeed. Very well. <laughs> The court accepts this photo into the record as evidence. Ooh. By the way, I can't quite tell the cause of death from this photo. <laughs> your reputation for sagacity is well earned, Your Honor. And by sagacious, I mean completely sagacious. <laughs> the truth is that this victim died a rather unusual death. An unusual death? What do you mean, <laughs> <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Ray? He said it! You he said, said it as early as five years before. Perhaps the defense would like to take this question. Huh? A simple question. I thought I might loosen you up a little bit. Oh. I'm a genteel man, if you will. Ugh. What? Uh, um, what? Stand up to him, Maya. Stand up to him, Mia. Show him what you got. Uh, perfect opportunity. Well, uh, what was it? Uh, the cause? Go on, no. Oh, p please say you know as much. Uh, I'm so sorry I didn't get a chance to read for the whole file. Oh, what the I'm frick? pretty sure that's oh, one of the first most important facts. How do you, sk yeah. how do you skim over that? <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I, think we know where, I think we know where Mia went to high school. My hemorrhoids <laughs> are getting jacked <laughs> Now, see here. The details of the case are filed under court record. But you knew that already, didn't you? Uh, the court record. I think I can see that by pressing the tab. The, the, what is this woman saying? What is this? What is tab? <laughs> All of the weapons we need can be found in the court record. Take a good hard look at the data there and think carefully before you answer, my dear. Y yes, sir. I'll oh. do just that. <sighs> I've got to stay calm. I can't let the pros prosecutor get the better of me. The court record. Okay, let's take a look. I just pressed tab here. <laughs> what is tab? <laughs> I have a badge. Ah, yeah, electric okay, shock. Time, the the badge. Now then, will the attorney for the defense please answer the question? What was the course of death? Electrocution. According to the court record, it was a fatal electric shock. In other words, electrocution. Electrocution? Hmm, but how could such a thing happen? Did the murderer use some type of super powerful stun gun, perhaps? <laughs> uh, the answer to that will become crystal clear as this trial proceeds, Your Honor. But before that, there is one more vital issue. Uh, well, what what's that? Why, motive, of course. Apparently, there was some bad blood between the victim and the defendant. Bad blood? You know they got bad blood. What do you mean? <laughs> Aha! Oopsie, I'm terribly sorry. You're the defense attorney, so you must know all about it. I shouldn't be stealing your spotlight like this. Jesus Christ, I really don't like this guy's smug attitude. <laughs> This wins in pain for you. He's a smooth swat of what that Ah, again. That's Winston pain for you. He's one smooth operator. If you catch my drift. Uh, no, I'd say he's more of a pain in the ass. Yeah. But, um, <laughs> I don't call him the rookie killer for nothing, you know. If he's if all he's good at killing if all he's good at is killing rookies, is he really a, a professional? Anyway. Now then, let's hear from the defense. What was the source of the bad blood between the victim and the defendant? And this time, I would like to see some supporting evidence. Um, evidence, yeah. Ah, uh, no need to get all worked up after this. Up for this. As I said, all our weapons can be used and can be found in the court record. Find the evidence found. you need, <laughs> and then shove it into old Greybeard's face. Hey! Oh, so you mean like I'll, I so many old people in this Yes, sir. Yeah, hit him with it. Old Not the weapons, the, 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 the facts. Uh, yes, yes, yes. yes. Uh, Don't actually kill him. Mr. <laughs> Roseberg, try to set a better example for the young lady. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, evidence isn't the only thing that cold record. Uh, evidence, uh, uh, 
Evidence isn't the only thing in the court record. People's profiles are as as well. You can toggle between profiles and evidence with tab, so be <laughs> sure to go all over it. Go over it all. Now, yeah. Is this like an introduction to the game? Got. Yeah, because it's yeah. a... Yeah, what was the cause of the bad blood Okay, let's go to profiles. Right so obviously. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh. 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 Oh, damn. Alia Hawthorne, is it? That's my daughter. Very good, Miss. You seem to have picked up on at least as much. This woman is the girlfriend of the defendant, Phoenix Wright. But up until about eight months ago, she was with the victim, Mr. Swallow. Clearly, she has some part to play in the story. Hmm. Ah, uh, he's done it again. Before the cross-examination starts, he's already got in the judge thinking like what he wants. Like he wants. Very well, Mr. Payne. Please call your first witness. Please, the court. The prosecution like to call Mr. Phoenix right. What? Ooh. The defendant himself? Well, Miss mm -hmm. Faye? It's fine. After all, Mr. Phoenix is innocent, all right? <laughs> the, defendant has, uh, the defense has no objection. Very well. The court calls Mr. Phoenix Wright to the witness stand. <laughs> oh, if he's gonna pull a fucking edge warp, I swear. Oh, no. Witness, please state your name and occupation. Oh, uh, yes, my, my name is Phoenix, Phoenix Fight, Phoenix Wright. My Remix. job is, um, <laughs> well, uh, right now, I guess I'm a suspect. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, he means what you do what did you do before you were arrested? Oh I, I, I was a I was a university student. Mr. Wright Fuck you. You understand that you're suspecting the death of your fellow but, student. But, 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 but I didn't do it. I I'm innocent, I tell you. I'm innocent, I'm Ew. telling you I was oh, I the mucus is in his face. The mucus is in his face mm. now, yeah. The defendant, please refrain from passing on his coal to the rest of us. <laughs> it seems the witness has something he wants to say. Hmm. Well then, Mr. Wright, please tell us about your relation to the victim. R right away, Your Honor. Ooh. Look at him, he's so cute. Look at his uh, mask, like, <laughs> bouncing He up became wacky him. like all the other witnesses. Yeah, he did. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice. Um, I... I admit I was there, but, but I'm not a killer. Oh, all I did was find his body. I hardly knew the guy to begin with. Mm. I never even talked to that stuck up British wannabe. No, oh, he's a oh, yeah. Okay. Good decision to voice him then. Mm, I see. So you hardly knew the victim. Right. Like I said, I'm not a killer. Wow, it looks like the judges understand. <laughs> You're being naive, you know. Too naive. Uh huh? Well, I'm a fave. <laughs> <laughs> it seems that you've forgotten one small thing, young lady. And that would be? This witness still has to undergo something called a cross examination. A cross examination? He's right. And it's all the. <laughs> And it's the defense's duty to carry out the cross-examination. The purpose is to determine if a witness's testimony contains any contradictions. Contradictions? Contradictions. If a witness is lying, their statements will conflict with the court record. But uh, Mr. Aid is my client. Even if he is your client in court, all lies must be struck down. As a lawyer, that is your duty, you see. What does he mean by that? Is he saying that the testimony just now... That it was a lie? A contradiction? No, I mean, yeah, I did too. Yeah, I, I sensed a lie somewhere. Your cross-examination, if you please, Miss Faye. Please, Mr. Wright, tell me you haven't been lying. <laughs> Look at him. Oh, so he cute. has. You wouldn't do that to me, <laughs> would you? He's so cute. Yeah, look at his eyes. Oh. 
Okay, so it's definitely like I never, I, I didn't, um, I uh, didn't really know the guy because then he called him like a British banana. Yeah, this is. Wait. It says right here that he he was a fourth year. It doesn't say they know each other though. Well, that's true. That's and plus, true. he was a fourth Maybe. year while he was a third year, so. Yeah. Yeah, people in other batches can't can't meet. That's against the law. That's against the law. <laughs> Why don't you uh, press it, maybe? Yeah. Press it? Oh, yeah, press. Well, I okay, forgot there I was press. an umbrella. Wait, did, didn't Phoenix have the umbrella, though? Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait, did he? I don't remember. I don't remember, sorry. Um, so, you didn't know his face, or even his name, right? Right. Uh, um, well, no. I, that is, I, I, I mean... You, uh... So, which is it? Do you know him or not? <laughs> now see here, you can't avoid answering the question by sneezing all day. Oh, That's a good strategy. Make not, me bad strategy. Sneeze. <laughs> not a bad strategy, actually. Yeah, actually. Uh, um, well, I guess I did know his name. News to me. Why didn't you tell me that before? It's such uh, a big role reversal, I just realized. Daniel's the witness, I'm the prosecutor. Yeah. Shaw's yeah. the main character, who was the assistant. <laughs> Big shake up. I, I, <laughs> What's going on? Ah, my head. Dolly. Ooh, careful. Who is this Dolly person? Ah, yes, that'd be the defendant's lover, Miss Dahlia Hawthorne. That's oh, a cute name. I see. Ah, young love. So bittersweet. But that's all I knew about him. <laughs> she looks British so out of his league, I'm sorry. <laughs> He what? was not British. <laughs> British, you say? He's Welsh. He's, he's Welsh. Welsh. He's, he's, he's Northern Scottish. Irish. <laughs> he's <laughs> not from the UK. He's from Northern Ireland. <laughs> Mr. Wright, nice. you stated the following. Uh, the, you stated in the following testimony. I hardly knew the guy to begin with. Th th that's right. I, I mean, why? Why would I even? But that doesn't sound right. If you hardly knew him, then why would you say that the victim was a stock of British wannabe? Ooh, checkmate. Hmm? Imagine hmm? being British. <laughs> 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 well, Mr. Wright? Uh, no, it wasn't me. I'm not a killer, I swear. Oh, God. Mr. Wright, I will give you an opportunity to revise your testimony. How is it that you knew the victim was, as you put it, a British, British wannabe? wannabe? Yes. He was a friend of the poor. Union oh. Jack. On the back of Union the Jack. This is going to yeah. mean I got to do a bad British accent. Shit. Wait, is what's Union a Union Jack? Jack? Like it's like the flag. Like a, it's the flag yeah. of the UK, right? Uh, yeah. It's like, no, it's like a blazer. Yeah, it's something like that. Union it could be like a British statement. Mm. Oh! Oh no, why did I press it? Oh wait, oh, oh wait, no, I, I, I have to press it. Anyway. Did you see the scene cri the crime scene? The Union Jack, I mean. Yes, that, that's right. I, I saw it at the crime scene. That's why, that's why I, I, I figured he must love British stuff. See? It, it's true. Cross my heart. I, I swear I didn't do it. He's acting shared <laughs> in the salmon I ate last night. May I ask you something? I to actually say? ate the salmon last night. You actually What else did you eat? Damn. You really did you have fish and chips. <laughs> you know. I kinda of want some fish and chips. Yes, Your Honor. Um what is it now? Who is this person anyway? This Union Okay, I'm yeah, just British. Fellow. Uh The Union Jacks the name yeah. of the United Kingdom's flag. Oh. oh, I see. Yeah. So you mean like the stars and stripes, right? As usual, Your Honor, your insight astounds me. Stop <laughs> buttering him up, bitch. So fiddling you with your sarcastic. Pencil. What the fuck is he <laughs> doing? He's just he likes it. It's bouncy. Yeah, but I don't think the <laughs> judge can read sarcasm. I, I think that's his stress ball. He like squeezes at least his stress yeah. ball. <laughs> his hair. I should get one too. Hey, gross, George, can you give me a stress ball? <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Um, hey, something that occurred to me. Isn't there something strange ab about this bit just now? Mia, is there a contradiction here? Oh, there is a contradiction here. M oh, Wait, Mr. Postberg! Quick, uh, quickly now, show me that boy. You mean the business with evidence, I mean. What? Show me that boy. Uh, <laughs> um, uh, okay, Mia, Quick, okay. Mia. 
check the court record. It's carefully. a bad mobile. I mean, the court record. It's gotta be this, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where is the Union Jack? We can. Obviously, we can't yeah, see we can the whole. Where is the British flag? Where is the British flag? Well, my dear, do you think you can manage on your own on this board? <laughs> I need some help. <laughs> <laughs> One year ago, I was in the courtroom just like this. I can do it. I can handle this myself. Are they talking about the DL6 incident, oh. by the way? May oh. Have. Probably. Probably. I, I, I'm guessing so. <clears throat> you mustn't try to bite off more than you can chew, Mia. I I'll be fine. I know what I have to do. Remember, you can always press him to get more information. Oh, I know. One more thing. When you're going to state a contradiction, make sure you present some definitive proof. My dad might be in court, but that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> he's, oh, no. he's a witness. He witnessed the crime. Oh, he no. witnessed the crime. He's he witnessed like... the crime. <laughs> My dad is like actually super sus. Uh, I, I didn't oh, do it. <laughs> I was driving. I can say that. I, oh, I like, like the drama. Like the, the, the thing. Oh, yeah. I didn't, I didn't even realize that. Oh, my God. Yeah, she got my okay, well, on it. Okay, Mia. One more time, from the very beginning of his testimony. There was no flag. Hey. Union. Yeah. Jackery. All right. Objection. Objection. Are you certain you saw the Union Jack? Y yeah, yeah I'm, I'm sure. It was right there on his back. Miss Fay, is there some point to this line of questioning? Your Honor, please take another look at a scene of crime. As you can see, there's absolutely nothing on the victim's back. Hey, oh, wait a minute. He, he's wearing a letter jacket. The, the, the Union Jack was on the back of the T-shirt. T, t he was. Wearing. I was under the impression you, that you accidentally came across the body. Oh, that's really sus. But if that was really the case, <sighs> you wouldn't know that, would you? <laughs> you would have no idea at all what he was wearing underneath that jacket. Ooh. Not bad. Mr. Wright, you've been lying to me. <laughs> Please forgive me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, you've made our client cry, even though he's a 20 year old man. What the fuck? <laughs> Let him that he on his chest doesn't stand for Phoenix anyway. Uh, <laughs> I couldn't believe I trusted him. Mr. Phoenix was all, was no. all wrong. <laughs> that was an impressive bit of cross-examination. Hmm. Thank you for uncovering the defendant's lies for me. It's quite simple. Huh. Oh, thank you. <clears throat> the man did not simply stumble upon the scene of the crime. Uh... Uh-oh. Did I go too far? By the way, Mr. Wright, you seem to have a rather bad cold. Have you taken any medicine for it? I, uh... Yeah, I took some, but... Was the medicine that you took an over-the-counter brand called Cold Killer X? Yeah, that's right. It kills colds good. Hey, wait a second. How did you know that I'm a big fan of Cold Killer X? <laughs> big fan? Man. <laughs> Would you happen to have that medicine with you right now? Well, actually, I, I seem to have lost it somewhere. He lost it? Does it even have anything to do with the, with the case? Mr. Wright, shall I tell you where your cold medicine is right now? In the uh -huh. defender's jacket. It's underneath your suit. Yeah, your, your Honor, I'd like to take another look at the photo from the crime scene. Whoa. Oh, it's in the What's this? In the victim's hand? It's... it's cold killer. V! <laughs> X! X, that means fire! I don't see you. Yes, but even I've got a photo of Cold Killer X in my apartment. I'm sorry, but I'm afraid that argument won't work. There's no doubt as to who this bottle of Cold Killer X belongs to. Especially with Mr. Phoenix and Mr. Wright's fingerprints all over it. What? what? That's right. Oh, Since he was murderous in ten, Mr. Swallow must have picked up the bomb of the medicine. Dropped by Mr. Wright and hidden in his hand. His purpose in doing so can only be to identify his killer as Phoenix Wright. 
I, I don't think he's that smart. Yeah. <laughs> Dumb. Order! Order in the court. Your Honor, I'd like to present this photo and bottle as evidence. Very well. The court will accept them into the record. Oh, snap. Let's watch. Oh, snap. Also, the victim's wristwatch was broken. Broken? Yes, it ceased functioning when a large wave of electricity passed through it. Well, Mr. Wright, do you have some kind of explanation for all of this? Uh... This is really bad. No, but... Mr. Grossman, that is too much information. I have stage two diabetes. <laughs> two old men bickering. Okay. Two old men bickering. The truth is, I, I, I went because he called me. He was in the pharmacology department, so we agreed to meet at 245 behind that building. We talked for a bit, and then around at 3 o'clock, we split up. Then later... When I went back, I I found him lying there. I'd been taking Cold Killer X for the last two or three days, but I lost my bottle of it around lunchtime on the day of the accident. Mr. Wright, that's completely different from the testimony you gave previously. <laughs> I'm sorry, Your Honor. I was afraid you wouldn't believe the truth. You can't handle the truth. Forgive me if I say I hardly find your current testimony any more credible. Hmm. Miss Faye, please begin your cross-examination. Oh, please. Mr. Wright, don't tell me any more lies. <laughs> Phoenix so Wright's nice, sweet little lies. I think that actually rhymes. Phoenix lied. Okay. Wait, yeah. uh, can we check out the court record? Court record. Um... Wait, go back. It was free, okay. No, 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 that won't make sense. Hmm. We walked away at the wrong. Wait, no! We talked for a bit and then around three we split up. But Instead then, how could he die three. and then. Yeah. Is it that simple? I, I don't know. Oh, wait! I don't, no. Oh, wait. no! It is the first carriage. Oh, the, the, the watch! We I can don't, approximate. I don't know okay, 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 wait. So this is 12, yeah. right? Yeah, no, that's about 3 or 12. It would make sense because, like, when the crime scene. Like was discovered, right? I guess. So when the police showed up to take photos, it would be around that time. Yeah. Well, no. That's the the, the watch the watch stopped working, things. right? Did it? It did. Yeah. Oh it, yeah. It, it, it said it stopped working, which means this is the exact oh, okay. time that he died. Nice, so this nice, looks nice. like three o five, maybe. I don't know how to read watch. Because this is a, this is twelve, basically. And this is 3 p.m. 3 or 3 or something. 3 or 3. 3 or, yeah. Um, point is, it's uh, a little past 3 o'clock. 3 or 5, yeah. Three or three. I don't think that's the contra. That's, that's like, they, they, they took the photo a little after, right? What, sorry? Logically. They, they, they took the photo a little after. Oh, wait, no, yeah. That does sound like a contra. Hmm. Oh, no. No, because it's right. What work with the execution? Around 3 o'clock. Around 3 o'clock. It would make I mean, he okay. Well, let's let's press this. So what is it? Uh, uh, okay. So what was it you were talking about? You know, <laughs> that maybe we should hang out again sometime. Again? Hang out sometimes. I wish that were true. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Wait, maybe we went back. Time-related stuff. Was it Mr. Swallow who inducted you should meet up at uh, 2.45 exactly? Yeah, it, we were both there right on time. Mm. You said the victim was in the pharmacology department, correct? Yeah, he was studying how to ma manufacture and improve pharmaceuticals. Ooh, is that why he had the yeah. pill bottle? Oh my god. Good sense, yeah, he was just a farmer. It would be still kind of weird to, like, always carry a bottle of pills with you. Even yeah. If you are a pharmacy. Oh, well. Uh, no, I think... Oh, maybe he's, yeah, trying Phoenix, to give him. Okay, yeah. Because Phoenix, Phoenix uh, he said he lost it around lunchtime. And yeah. maybe, like, dude found it and they wanted to give him back to him. Or give him, like, new maybe. pills. Maybe, yeah. I think it's Maybe. the same one because you can see like there's empty. Um, no, yeah, and he doesn't things. have it right now, so it's like. Yeah. yeah. It makes more sense. Mm -hmm. 
Everyone called him the alchemist of IVU. An alchemist? I see. I Ooh, gotta admit, it was a little suspicious. He had a whole lab laboratory and everything. Oh. Mm. He's, a drug <laughs> He's a druggie. It was filled with chemicals and strange machines. Yes. And, you know, these blue crystals and plastic bags. I have no idea. What is he making? <laughs> Running high voltage electricity. Oh, how fascinating. He sounds like he was a quite ambitious young man. What do I do? Maybe I should, I should ask him for more details? Yes. I w so you were absolutely certain that you met up at 2.45? Yeah, pretty sure that that's the time class ends. But they're always doing some experiments, so it doesn't matter much. Experiments, you say? Yeah, those pharmacology guys are always whipping up, whipping up something in the lab. Well, it looks like he's right about this time. Anyway. Ugh. Wait! Just go! Just go on with your testimony! Hmm. I, I think, think we should pick I think a different something option. happened in the laboratory. Some chemicals came yeah, okay. up and he died. But... Became the Joker. So let's ask about the laboratory, the though. Yeah. It's underneath the laundromat. Whoa! <laughs> and it was secretly built. Forget about it. My Germans. I was wondering if you could tell us a bit more about the from pharmacology. Pharmacology. How do you say it? Pharmacology department. Well, okay, sure. I don't all I don't know all that much about it though. A little earlier in your testimony, you said something interesting. You said the department uses a strange machine that runs on high value electricity. That's right, and they sure look dangerous. They use non-standard voltages, so there are high voltage cables everywhere. High voltage cables. Yeah, there were electric poles set up all around the building. The high voltage cables run overhead around the roof. Finally, I think we're getting somewhere. Yay. Hmm. But he doesn't add it to his testimony, goddammit. <laughs> you dumb um... Phoenix. Then I think, um... Maybe we should Maybe I press this? I found him my... So, you say you went back. Um, yeah, that's when I found the body. Yes, but why did you go back in the first place? Weren't you angry with him? Well, th that's right. I was. Then why, Mr. Phoenix? Why would you go back there? <laughs> Good um, I thought maybe we could make up. Mm. Out? Make out. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I like where this is going. What the hell? That's it! That's it! Don't this way. I'm pretty sure no one is buying this. I kind of want to believe that he's giving Phoenix really bad pills to make him more sick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's why he's really sick. I don't know. far fetch, but it seems funny. Huh. That's my little around lunchtime on that day. What would you classify as lunchtime? What do you have for lunch? Uh, Keep on on that day of the accident, what did you do for lunch? What did you eat? Huh? What, what does that have to do with anything? <laughs> you can never be too sure. I always eat with Dolly. Just the <laughs> two of us, we else? could make it if we tried. If we tried. Dolly's homemade lunches are just the greatest. Mm, her mini omelettes are magically delicious. <laughs> oh, now I'm hungry. Yo, why'd you punch me in the jaw? What's a... oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> Did you just all of a sudden? What? I think that's oh, enough like for me. now. So the defendant and the victim at approximately the time of his death. And then, oh, the defendant would turn to the scene for some unknown reason. I'm not entirely convinced by his explanation about the best model either. Let me be frank here, Mr. Wright. Your testimony cannot be trusted. What do you mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> he said the line! <laughs> he said... Pray to listen. I don't 
think she's that little. Like, 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 yeah, probably just as old as Phoenix when he started. Anyway. Oh, I have my bad mix, <laughs> However, there is one mystery that still remains. There is your honor. Mm hmm. How the murder was carried out, of course. Just how was the victim electrocuted? I don't believe the murder weapon has been produced yet, correct? Well, that is, I. You are correct, Your Honor. Hmm. So, how exactly was Mr. Swallow killed? If I could somehow establish how it was done, maybe I can still come out of this mess smelling like a rose. Establish the murder weapon. Oh, we come on. Now, Why are they we? throwing these kinds of dilemmas as early as now? Um, hey, look at the cold record. Look okay, okay. Let's look at the the first crime scene again. Can't go that well. How the so fuck the did that thing get cut? The umbrella? And why is that umbrella bent? Yeah. Something something ruptured the wire, and I guess it swung down and it... You know, that's, that's why he... Uh, yeah. Because I have a feeling it was the umbrella, but why is the umbrella there? Yeah. I don't know if it was the umbrella. How could it I mean, cut it's... something so sturdy? I know, but it it's weirdly like Hmm. Maybe the umbrella had knives. <laughs> the umbrella was actually a gun. I actually designed one of those for a school. That's how it was killed. The umbrella guy with the gun. His gun was an umbrella. I say we gun. can't think, establish I think, it. Right uh, now. The penguin. The penguin from Batman had one. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you know, Neapolitan from Ruby, the guy from Golden Ring. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not Golden. So, yeah, what do you guys say? I say we can't. Can't? I say we can't. Okay, I mean, like, we have to always press establish murder, because that's the way to go, but honestly, we can't. Yeah. I think we can. But really? I'm sure. What makes you say that? I have a feel, I have a small hunch. We don't have enough evidence, but I feel if we choose the right things. The last but, thing I guess thing safer is? option. Safer Just option. remember what the, the question is. It's not who did it, it's how did they do it. Hmm. Then I guess it well, we know that it was with the, with the wire. So do you think we could use yeah, it? They're, yeah, they're not asking who, they're asking how. Oh, yeah, no. Wait. I mean, yeah, no, exactly. So we don't know. Sus as hell. How did, wait, wait, wait. Because it happened by electrocution. How the fuck did Phoenix do it? Lightning shoots from his fingertips. Yeah, well, that's the thing. Ah. We're trying to prove how he was electrocuted. Yeah, we don't have to think about how Phoenix did it. We just have to figure out how he was killed. Oh, you know, okay, the umbrella. He has electricity, electricity fingers. So Lightning does. shoots from his fingertips. So, wait, established? Wait, 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 the umbrella. The I know, umbrella, I know when, when you're electrocuted, like something in your body changes. As in, like, um, I, I don't know. Oh, yeah, you get a bone, <coughs> technically. No, <laughs> <laughs> <Someone, no. laughs> Electrical <laughs> stimuli in a muscle. Like, that's what it was. <laughs> Damn it. Also, I think we can establish the, the method. The okay, umbrella. I think so too. Like, if, uh, if we know that he was killed with a wire. I'm like relatively confident that like the umbrella hit the wire. <gasps> okay, Your Honor. <laughs> Your Honor. Yes, Miss Faye. I believe that if we were to piece together everything we've heard up so until now, we should be able to solve this mystery of how Mr. Swallow died. Did someone join? I don't yeah. know. Yeah. That's weird. Huh? That's weird. Okay, hold on. Mm -hmm. That would be most impressive. Of course, Dad. Hee hee. Hee hee. Quite the brash statement. Hee hee. Quite the brash coming from a rookie. Moonwalk. But even a beginner like you must understand the basic rules of the court, yes? An attorney must be able to substantiate their arguments with evidence. <clears throat> Of course I know that. Actually, I had totally forgotten about that. <laughs> oh, I see why she's Phoenix Mentor now. No, then. Yeah, actually, she, she says a lot of, like, mannerisms with uh, Phoenix. You can tell he learned a lot from her. No, then, Miss Faye. Let me see what you've got. Show me how you believe the victim was electrocuted. I mean, yes, you see me photo. Um, quite Ella, obvious. Ella, Ella, a... <laughs> I mean, we, do um, we just Barana. present the photo? I feel like, yeah. I yeah, that's pretty presented. straightforward. Maybe a point-and-click thing, like, woo. 
us for the cause of death. Um, See if the gamble pays I'll off. I'll take this picture, Captain. Yay! What? what? Our gamble pays off. But there is nothing that even remotely resembles a murder weapon here. Hmm, I'm afraid the defense is going to have to have to explain this in a bit more detail. Miss Faye, where yeah, exactly in this photo is the murder weapon? Um, I think it's from the... the oh, 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 your honor, it's obviously the umbrella. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I hope it. I hope it's not like pixel perfect. Okay, there we go. Uh, yeah, what do you think this is? The jar? The jar? Not, yeah. The most safe nothing jar? Nothing will ever be as bad as the jar ever again. Nothing, nothing will ever be as bad as the jar ever again. They learn from game design. Oh, Good. Uh, the fucking jar. Right. Right. What is that? A severe electrocute cable, I believe, Your Honor. Remember the testimony we've heard? The machine, the, fir the firm quality student uses in their experiments. Requires a high voltage, and because of that, the special high voltage cable sprung up everywhere. So then, the high voltage cable. Yes, the high voltage cable is the cause of death. That is most likely split explanation. Mm, that certainly sounds plausible. Well, Mr. Payne, what do you have to say about all this? Like, honestly, wait, if he rejects that uh, you, that it wasn't the, the wire, how does this guy think he died? Like, let's... I, honestly, did he think he was, like, electrocuted with a taser or something? The umbrella! What, did, what were uh, you getting at, Payne? The umbrella had a taser in it. It wasn't an umbrella gun, it was a taser umbrella. Oh my god, James Bond! It's the most James advanced Bond. umbrella of all time. Don't toy with me, old man. Oh. Oh, snap. Now, now, the victim's cause of death may have indeed been a high-voltage cable. However, I want you to think about what that really implies. The only one who had the opportunity to use the cable as a murder weapon was... The judge. The defendant. What? <laughs> <laughs> oh, he sneezed so he it, it was right. Damn. That much is certainly true. Yes, and that's not all. We have proof. Irrefutable proof that will establish Mr. Wright as the murderer. You, you do? Well, what is it? His fingerprints. Fingerprints? You mean that the defendant's finger. fingerprints were on something <laughs> besides the medicine <laughs> bottle? Wait, no, no it's fingerprints. Prints. No, the no, kidney print. Paint, paint? Let's take a look at it. There's, there's, there's a meme where it's like, let's finger paint. Uh, <laughs> paint. It's like crying. <laughs> Wait, Let's take a look at the crime scene photo. What are you saying, Sean? As you can see, the victim is wearing a leather jacket. And as you may know, leather holds fingerprints quite well, does it? Huh? Y you mean? Yes. It was quite clearly imprinted on the chest of the area of the victim's jacket. The palm print of the def defendant's very own hand. What? I can only think of one way that Mr. Wright could have left a print like that. Intent of murder, he squarely pushed the victim towards the severed electric cable. All set. Poor guy. Order! 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 That's enough! I think we can conclude that there was no reason to continue with this cross examination. Hmm. Stick a fog in us. We're done. <laughs> Mr. Ghostbird! Oh, my hemorrhoids never die. <laughs> the show is over, Mia. I knew that boy was guilty the first time I saw him. Look at his spiky hair. No, He's no, you're wrong. Of... He's not spiky. He's just using some weird conditioner. Um, Mr. Phoenix is innocent. No further evidence is required to convince me of this man's guilt. Your Honor! At this time, I am prepared to render a verdict in this case. Ah, shit. <gasps> dun, dun. Do you have something further to add, Miss Faye? Is that what you want, Mr. Wright? <gasps> yes. You still have a hold of the truth. The whole truth. If you don't say something now, the judge is going to hand down his verdict. But, oh, no. but, but, but I, I can't. I, I just can't say it. 
If I told you what really happened, then I, I, I'd be, be... It's okay, Mr. Phoenix. I'm your attorney. You can trust me. A lawyer you can trust. Miss Fay. No matter what it, that you have to say, I believe in you. And I'll represent you until the very end. No. Is your mouth full? There's no need to first. There's no further need to do it for him to say anything. <laughs> He's oh, eating boy. his hair. Oh God. He just like. He's eating so all the dandruff in his hair. Oh. Oh, He's a stress eater. He's a stress eater. Stress, eater. <laughs> stress ball eater. Wait, wait a minute. Always for the angle because he was always like sideways. Mr. Phoenix, I'm Mr. Wright. I, I'll i tell you what really happened. No, you won't. I've already told you, Mr. Wright. There's no need for further. Uh, <laughs> I... I... did it. I did it! I punched him! It's my fault. M my fault that the Doug Swallow is dead. Drugs, drug swallow. He swallowed the drug. Yo. Drug hey, that's your it's none of your business. Oh, I got it. I'm telling you, it wasn't for your sake. If you would continue seeing her, it's going to be a bad idea. You're lying. Just listen to me. There's something you need to know about that girl. Stop it. D don't <sighs> talk about her like that. Damn, that was a big show. Oh. You dead, dead a hell. That's fucking damn it. Phoenix! Uh, what you just said, was that the truth? Y yes. I, I, I was afraid. Afraid that if I told the truth, everyone would think I was the murderer for sure. Well, as things currently stand, we're all absolutely convinced you are. Please, please give me one more chance to explain. This time, I swear, I swear I'll tell the whole truth. It'll be okay. Won't it, Miss Faye? I believe in you. Oh, um, um, actually, no. You just gave us away. I really did push the victim. <laughs> Feels like my hemorrhoids are doing the Harlem Shake. <laughs> funny trivia, funny trivia for you. Yeah. Harlem Shake was invented like in the 90s, right? And Filthy Frank brought it back oh, in, like, really? in 2013. In like 2013, right? This game was written in 2001. Uh, 2004 or whatever. Right? Uh, <laughs> no wonder. Okay. Now, what year does this take place? This is five years before the events of, of the current game, which is 2018. So this takes place no in 2013. Way. So Mr. Oh, Grossberg watches God. Filthy Frank. Mr. Grossberg <laughs> watches Grossberg Filthy Frank. He planned this from the beginning. <laughs> Mr. Grossberg likes Filthy Frank. It's confirmed. <laughs> that guy. He was talking bad about Dolly. Oh! I lost Dude, my temper so and gave him a shove. So At that violent. moment, I heard some kind of loud noise. A little while after I left, I, I started to get worried. So I went back, but he, he was lying there. Dead. Hmm, well, the explanation is really quite simple. When you pushed him, Mr. Swallow flew back and touched the electrical cable. He died from the shock, and that, as they say, is that. Hmm, a simple explanation indeed. At the time of the incident, a light rain had been falling. Wet from the rain, the victim was more easily electrocuted. But, but, but when I pushed him, there weren't any electrical cables nearby. If there had been something like that, even I would have noticed it. That's true. Even Duffus like him could have it spelled that? like that? Yeah, right. Duffus. Duffus. <laughs> Duffus. <laughs> it's for, for dummies like me to understand. Did someone say Doof? <laughs> <laughs> no, not you again. Hmm. Miss Faye, let me warn you right now that if your cross-examination doesn't yield any new facts, I intend to deliver my verdict without any further delay. Are we clear on that? Y yes, Your Honor. Don't give up, Mia. 
he's innocent. There must be some kind of evidence somewhere that will prove it. Right? Uh, so that will be the Harlem Shake. <laughs> he did the Harlem Shake. Your Honor, he oh, did nice. the Harlem Shake. Oh, oh, that was oh. it. There's <laughs> only five, yeah. Oh, good. Unless we can find something that shows his innocence from the testimony, my dear. I'm afraid the judge will make his final decision with no remorse whatsoever. Uh, yes, sir. Oh, right now I need some info. Info that will help me turn up some contradiction. Hmm. Okay. We should press. <laughs> okay. A loud noise. And what would you say that loud noise was, Mr. Wright? I'm not sure, but it was really loud. It was like, snap. You know, come to think of it. I wonder what that was. <laughs> and I was helping your case, Clearly, Your Honor, it was the sound of the victim being electrocuted. You're not qualified to decide that. What the frick? What did I do? I'm heading on some dangerous ground here. Oh, you want to leave him alone and, you know, no. Usually when we, when we, when we, when it's not good. Mr. Bite, that loud noise we heard might be extremely important. So try to remember what it was. Um, how do I put it? It was like, it was like a sharp crack. Aha! Uh -huh. Could it be? Could have it been? Yeah, yes, yes, could have been. Hurry up and tell us. When I pushed him, he dropped the umbrella he was holding. Oh, he was holding the umbrella. Ah. <laughs> this is like Phoenix, Phoenix writes uh, Smash Bros. Final <laughs> Smash, he just pushes someone. <laughs> Shove. <laughs> Shove. Uh... Final attack. Shove. Game. He fell right on top <laughs> of it, and it broke. That was probably the noise smash. I heard. And did that umbrella belong to the victim? Yeah, it was a plastic umbrella. Cheap and frail, kind of like the owner. <laughs> Speaking ill of the dead. Stop it. Beat oh, it. You're treading on dangerous ground. Then again, I wish I had any kind of umbrella. I was totally soaked to the bone. Hmm. Miss Faye, what do you think? Is there something important in that testimony just now? Um, well... Of course, of course. Yes, it's important. Yeah, I'm just gonna bullshit this. This is this is it, Mia. The information you you've been waiting for. Oh, of course, it's important. No, this cheap umbrella is more important. It's vital. I want to officially have it entered into the testimony. Ah, how perfectly fitting! Flimsy information for a flimsy lawyer. Oh, shut it, you old balding man. I can't uh, raise to an offender's request. I respect your elders, Miss Fang. Witness! <laughs> I'll be the puppet work. Yeah. Please add a bit about the cheap umbrella to your testimony. Oh, man. I'm sorry, but what? he looks like an off of Jojo. Wanna be? <laughs> Just kidding. No, he didn't. What? <laughs> Is it the umbrella broke? He's not on top. Yeah. He's clearly not on yeah, top. Yeah, What? One, it's shall, on we, shall we present so this? Broke. Yeah, but then there was another thing that broke. Okay. Okay. Why didn't you testify about the umbrella from the very beginning? Come on. If I had mentioned that. I would have been. I would have never been able to counter the, the prosecution argument earlier. What, what? What do you mean by that? What do you mean? Take another look at the scene of crime. <laughs> According to Mr. Wright, the victim fell on top of his umbrella. However, if you look closely, the umbrella is nowhere near the victim. Actually, it's by the electrocution pole. You're absolutely right! The conclusion there is obvious. After the defendant left, the victim moved from where he fell, in other words... After he was pushed by the defendant, Mr. Swallow was still alive! 
Oh, oh well, damn. <laughs> His hair. The shape shifted. Okay. Order, order, order. The victim. He moved. Mr. Payne, the umbrella in this photo, where is it now? Oh, well, it, it was collected by the police in the crime scene. I want it presented as evidence immediately. <laughs> but the umbrella could have simply blown it by there by the wind. Objection, but it was under him. He According to it, testimony, yeah. the victim fell on top of the umbrella. Oh. There was simply no way it could have been blown here by the wind. I like the music. I can't yeah. hear the music. <laughs> <laughs> I know this matter of the umbrella seems relatively trivial, but as long as the smallest doubt remains, I cannot render final judgment. No! Jesus Christ! What if he said, oh, what if he said so something cool. else that began with N? He just said, "Nerds." <laughs> I must say, I still find it hard to believe that a huge hole has been blown in the prosecution's case by the defendant's testimony. How yeah, blown. <laughs> <laughs> Swallow. Like the... Oh, I meant by the wind. Oh, well, no, well done, done dear! <laughs> <laughs> well done! No matter who goes I must, okay. as the <laughs> Japanese say. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Payne. What's so funny? You want to hear a joke, Your Honor? Pardon me, Your Honor. It seems I'm expecting too much of a free ride. It was a fo it was foolishly, foolishly, foolish to think that I could examine <laughs> guilt through cross examination alone. You would call me? I'm afraid I don't follow what you're saying. That's not the kind of humor we do on this show. <laughs> Francisca's like 13 at this point. Yeah, she's, yeah, she's really young. Like so is Maya, actually. Yeah. Guys, come on, just let me be the prosecutor! You're like 12. Oh. I think, uh, didn't, didn't she get her prosecuting license when she was 13? She's already prosecuted. Oh, yeah, yeah. oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, she yeah, got no, she was like, Oh my god. <laughs> she got case. No. God damn. Oh, yeah, she got my case Germany, Germany. Germany. Yeah. Uh, go ahead, Sha. Oh, yeah. Okay. Let me guess. You have another witness? Exactly, and this witness's testimony will be incontrovertible. By incontrovertible, I mean completely incontrovertible. Completely mm, that's not good. Oh, sir. Wait, that's not good. That's not good. <laughs> well, oh. who is this witness? Miss Dahlia Hawthorne. Miss oh, Dahlia Hawthorne? You don't mean Dolly? Dolly. I do, Your Honor. The defendant's very own lover is a witness to the whole thing. What? Oh, shit. That's right. She was at the scene of the crime when the murder took place. Yo! Uh-huh. <laughs> I'm sorry to break the bad news to you, my dear. Hmm. <laughs> it makes her drop a whole lot easier. <laughs> bad news. Couldn't be more wrong. Actually, I've been waiting for this. All along. You can't be serious. Why so serious? What do you mean by that? I think this is a good point for us to stop at. Court will now enter a 20 minute recess. Afterwards, we will listen to the testimony of Miss Dahlia Hawthorne. Woo! Recess, pal! Recess! I love recess. Woo. It's my favorite Actually, class. Actually, wait. <laughs> it's my favorite class. Is still in school? I wonder. Oh, he's like, he's like uh, 30 or something. He's like 30? Okay, never mind. He's like 20. He's yeah. in his like mid 20s, right? Well, we'll, we'll check when we can, I guess. Okay. <laughs> we'll check his age. Miss Faye, I'm sorry about what happened back there. I... I... It's alright. At least you told us the truth at the end, Mr. Wright. <laughs> yeah. So, I guess I can start to relax then, huh? No. Relaxed, my boy, who can't be serious! After hiding such important facts? <laughs> but... But the next witness is my, is my dolly, right? She'll save me. I just know she will. Uh, I, have a, I have a start sure. feeling she doesn't like you, and she was using you, and she's the real murderer, you know? Yeah, you know, you didn't consider that. I we had a feeling that <laughs> Why do you think your that? dolly isn't really your dolly. Huh? What do you mean? She, oh, she's the love of my life, oh, well. that's why. Listen, we don't see her in future games, therefore I don't, I don't know how. <laughs> oh wait, okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's a good way to put it. Yeah. <laughs>
<laughs> the love of your point. life, huh? <laughs> it's just me. It's like, what are you talking about? <laughs> Breaking the fourth wall. Well, would you mind telling me more about you and uh, Miss Dahlia? Hardworth? Will? Sure. No problem. Dolly and I, we first met about eight months ago, right here in this very courthouse. The fuck? Actually, I'm oh, starting to be a doing. lawyer on the side. Anyway, one day, she and I just bumped into each other in the reading room downstairs. That's why I really think it was fate that brought us together. As soon as I first set eyes on her, I knew she was the one for me. Oh, here, take a look at this. She gave this to me the day we met as a symbol of our love. She'd been wearing it around her neck that day. But then, she took it off. But before she gave it to me, she said, I want you to carry this. So she gave it to you as a present, I say. <laughs> this darling little bottle is filled with memories of my darling little dolly. Oh, oh, ew. Um, wait, can we talk about the fact that they look like <laughs> the, the kid with the drink, like the, another drink, the, um, you know, the, yeah, I do drugs type of boy, you know, like, I'm a player, I see my mom's car, and she looks like, oh, well, I'm a happy princess, haha, <laughs> yeah, he got the drip. He got the drip. He got the drip. It's like the song, uh, Phoenix be uh, dripping. Yeah. It's like the song, who was a girl, she was a boy, can I be a day anymore? <laughs> <laughs> I think it's an AMV of, of Phoenix, <laughs> Skater Boy. Oh, yeah. oh my god, Phoenix was so AMV, annoying back in, back in college, I swear. Oh, okay. It makes me so happy. I show it to everyone I meet. I want to oh. share my happiness with the whole world. I bet he's I allergic to whatever's people. inside that thing. Yeah. Um, okay. Anyway. <laughs> So after you and Mr. H Hawthorne started dating? Yeah, but she's so shy. Every time I see her, she's always she always says the same thing to me. Please give it back now. <laughs> um. <laughs> um. Well, it was a strange girl asking for a present back like that. Uh, uh. By the way, Mr. Wright, are you sure not, like, um, diagnosed with any disease, you know, like, uh, hallucination, maybe making up st stuff, you know? Have you got tested, Mr. Wright? Do you have any STDs? Do you have any STDs? <laughs> um, the day you first met Dahlia, uh, eight months ago, I'm not gonna say your last name, it's an army. It wouldn't happen to be around August 27th, would it? Huh? Yeah, it was, but how did you... Oh, shit. This happened on August 27th, right here in this courthouse. What's this? A newspaper clipping? Let's see. Murder in the courthouse? Murder! Murder? What are you reading there? Let me see that. I'll do it again! Let me know, little. Oh, oh, I see. Murder? Yeah, I think I understand what you're trying to say. And I think I understand why you suddenly took such a keen interest in this case. You believe there is some connection between this case and the other case, am I correct? Oh, yes, I think it's just a killer for both of them. I hope you don't mind, Mr. Goldsberg. I, I need to finish this myself. Ah, yes, but I'm afraid what you have will not be enough, my dear. I'll go and have a look downstairs in the reading room and see what else I can find. Th thank you. I want to do whatever I can be, do to be help to you, Mia. Maybe just oh, jog thanks. slowly. <laughs> well, it looks like recess is about over. We better all get moving. I guess so. But recess sure seemed longer than 20 minutes, though. Shorter. <laughs> no, it seems longer. Ooh. I decided. Continued. Oh. Well, we'll see you guys okay. next time. Oh, I miss saying that. <laughs>